All right, to start this tie off, we're gonna begin with the bite, and we're gonna go ahead and create a lark's head with the bite and slot it over our wrist. If you think about when you're either gathering hair for a ponytail or a bun, you typically have a hair tie on your wrist as you gather the hair and then throw that hair tie on top. We're gonna to be doing the exact same thing with the rope here. So as I go ahead and gather the hair, on the right hand side you'll notice that I'm gathering for a high ponytail. On the left hand side is more of a centered ponytail. This is all dependent upon the direction that you plan on pulling the hair. In this example, I'm gonna be pulling the hair up. So the right hand side is actually what I should be doing. The left hand side, the only reason I'm gathering a centered ponytail is so that I could show to the camera exactly what's happening. Otherwise the rope is out of view. Now you'll see what I just did there was once I threw that lark's head in, I went ahead and spread it and collapsed it. So those two little rope lines that were on top, I went ahead and spread them and I pulled the running end to collapse and create a U-shaped bend within that hair, which gives us a really nice structure to tie onto. Now I'm just throwing a couple of half twists and make sure that you're building towards the scalp. Um, you want to be layering those on top of each other to get all of that friction in the hair. This is what actually creates enough friction so that your tie doesn't slide off the hair. One thing I made a point of doing is I had my model here uh, shower, use shampoo and conditioner, as well as her styling products after. They give her a really smooth finish, so her hair is extremely slick here. Um, so it's as slippery as it could possibly be, but even when I throw this upline, you'll notice that there's no slippage on the right hand side. And on the left hand side, there's a small amount of slippage, um, but this is more so due with, uh, again, the directionality of the hair that I'm pulling. Um, that I mentioned earlier, is that since I'm not pulling evenly, I'm pulling more from the bottom of the scalp, since I'm going up with the direction and I gathered a center pony, there's a little bit of slippage there. So once again, that directionality really comes into play here. That was my simple hair tie. Hope you enjoyed it.